Self-deception, a psychological phenomenon rooted in cognitive and social psychology, involves unconsciously distorting reality to protect self-esteem, reduce anxiety, or align beliefs with desires. It enables individuals to maintain a positive self-image and cope with life's challenges. Though excessive self-deception can hinder growth, relationships, and decision-making. Conceptual Foundations of Self-Deception Self-deception is distinct from conscious deception in that it operates at an unconscious or semi-conscious level. Key characteristics include Definition and Characteristics A simultaneous belief in two conflicting ideas The presence of a bias toward positive self-perception Avoidance of Cognitive Dissonance Historical Perspectives Philosophical Roots Early thinkers like Friedrich Nietzsche and Jean-Paul Sartre discussed the role of self-deception in maintaining existential equilibrium. Psychological Emergence In the 20th century, Freud's theories on repression and denial laid the groundwork for modern psychological studies on self-deception. Theoretical Frameworks Cognitive Dissonance Theory, Festinger, 1957, suggests that individuals deceive themselves to reduce the discomfort of conflicting beliefs. Motivated Reasoning highlights how desires and motivations influence cognitive processes, leading to biased interpretations of reality. Cognitive Mechanisms Underpinning Self-Deception Memory Distortions Selective recall. Remembering information that aligns with one's self-concept while forgetting contradictory evidence. Reconstructed memories. Altering past memories to fit current beliefs. Biases and heuristics. Confirmation bias. Seeking evidence that confirms pre-existing beliefs while ignoring disconfirming data. Optimism bias. Overestimating positive outcomes and underestimating negative consequences. Dual process models. The dual process model explains how we think in two ways. System one is fast, automatic, and emotional, helping us make quick decisions without much thought. System two is slower, logical, and deliberate, used for solving complex problems or making careful choices. Both systems influence our decisions and behaviors. Social Psychology of Self-Deception Self-Deception in Interpersonal Relationships Impression Management Individuals deceive themselves to present a favorable image to others, often believing their self-enhancements to be genuine. Conflict Avoidance Self-deception helps maintain harmony by ignoring or rationalizing negative aspects of relationships. Group Dynamics Collective Self-deception Groups can collectively deceive themselves, leading to phenomena like groupthink or shared illusions. Cultural Influences Different cultures may encourage self-deceptive behaviors, such as collectivist cultures prioritizing harmony over individual honesty. Social Comparison Festinger's Social Comparison Theory suggests that individuals often engage in self-deception to maintain a favorable comparison with others. Motivational Aspects of Self-Deception Ego Protection and Enhancement Self-Serving Bias Attributing successes to internal factors and failures to external ones. Illusion of Control Believing one has control over uncontrollable events. Avoidance of cognitive dissonance. Self-deception serves as a defense mechanism to reconcile conflicting attitudes, beliefs, or behaviors. Fear and anxiety management. Suppressing or reinterpreting threatening information reduces anxiety and preserves emotional equilibrium. Self-deception and mental health. Adaptive versus Maladaptive Self-Deception While self-deception can serve protective purposes, excessive or 
Maladaptive forms may contribute to psychological disorders such as narcissism or denial in addiction. Self-deception in disorders. Depression. Depressed individuals may exhibit less self-deception, leading to a more realistic but harsher self-assessment. Addiction. Denial of dependency is a common form of self-deception in substance abuse. Resilience and coping. Positive illusions, a form of self-deception, can enhance resilience and well-being by fostering optimism. Empirical studies on self-deception. Laboratory experiments. Research on implicit biases and subliminal priming demonstrates how unconscious processes contribute to self-deceptive behaviors. Studies using cognitive dissonance paradigms reveal how individuals alter their attitudes post-choice to align with their decisions. Neuropsychological evidence. Brain imaging studies highlight the role of the prefrontal cortex in suppressing contradictory information, supporting self-deceptive tendencies. Longitudinal studies. Long-term research links moderate self-deception with positive life outcomes such as career success and relationship satisfaction. While extreme forms correlate with maladjustment. Applications and interventions. Therapeutic approaches. Cognitive behavioral therapy, CBT, helps individuals identify and challenge self-deceptive thought patterns. Mindfulness practices. Encourage awareness of unconscious biases, and promote authenticity. Personal development. Self-awareness exercises, journaling, and feedback from trusted individuals can help reduce self-deception. Organizational implications. Promoting transparency and accountability in workplaces minimizes collective self-deception and enhances decision-making. Ethical and philosophical considerations. Moral implications. The ethicality of self-deception is debated, with arguments balancing its protective functions against its potential to harm others. Philosophical questions. Does self-deception challenge the notion of free will? Philosophers argue whether it is an inherent flaw or an adaptive trait. Societal impacts. On a macro level, self-deception influences public opinion, political ideologies, and cultural narratives. Contemporary challenges and future directions. Technological influences. The rise of social media and artificial intelligence may amplify self-deceptive behaviors. Interdisciplinary research. Integrating insights from psychology, neuroscience, and sociology can deepen understanding and develop innovative interventions. Global implications. Addressing collective self-deception in areas like climate change or public health is critical for global well-being. Conclusion Self-deception, a complex interplay of cognitive and social processes, shapes how individuals perceive and interact with the world. While it can serve adaptive purposes by preserving mental health and promoting resilience, unchecked self-deception poses risks to personal integrity and collective progress. Understanding its mechanisms and implications not only enriches psychological theory, but also offers practical tools for fostering authenticity and informed decision-making in personal and societal contexts. By further exploring the intersections of self-deception with technology, culture, and global challenges, researchers can unlock new dimensions of this enigmatic human trait, paving the way for a more self-aware and ethical society. Hello everyone. I am very excited to share my new YouTube video with you, and I need your support to continue to bring quality and enriching content. If you enjoyed my content, please help me by. Like the video, it helps me reach more people and spread the message. Subscribe to the channel, using the subscribe button below, so you don't miss any new update or video. Press the bell to receive notifications every time I upload new content. And if you would like to support me directly and help me create more content, you are welcome to join me on Patreon. Your support is significant for me and allows me to continue investing in creating quality and enjoyable content for you. Thank you so much for joining and watching, 
I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. See you in the next video.